Jerry DeLamas is re-entering New Hampshire politics. The Seacoast conservative activist is hoping to re-establish his Rochester 912 project as the campaign trail must stop for right-leaning candidates it was in the Tea Party era. Republican U.S. Senate hopeful Don Bolduc attended Monday night's meeting. I've watched for quite a while uh, our, the demise of our of our politics and uh, on both sides of the aisle, it wasn't just the Democrats, Republicans as well. And uh, and and I my hope is at least in New Hampshire is to be able to help clean some of that up and to help get some good candidates into office. Delema spent five years in prison for his role in the 2014 Bundy Ranch standoff in Nevada. He was released in November of last year. While his politics never changed, his perspective has. We don't need to lock up our whole society. Our people need to be locked up. Absolutely there are. But, but what we need to do is get people into positions of uh, in judges and, 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 and in the prosecutions who are going to actually seek justice. Behind bars, DeLamus focused on Christian ministry and became increasingly frustrated by the divisions he saw deepening outside the prison walls. Just the, the, uh, the vitriol uh, in the media. Uh, and and the uh, and within the parties and just with neighbors and uh, that's going to stop. We we we, we won't exist uh, if we're divided. We will fall and uh, we need to reunite. Recovering that unity might be beyond the capability of today's politics, but Delamus believes the process starts by vetting candidates for character and patriotism. I want them to love this country, and we can differ in opinions, and, and, and I've always said that. We can have difference of opinions, but we can, we can be respectful to one another, but also we've got to have integrity. Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.